and welcome to the video, Professor. This is a colour grading breakdown of something that I shot at the Henderson here in Hong Kong. I was commissioned by a company in Australia to do this piece to camera and I wanted to have a go at grading it as if I was commissioned to do so. I shot on the Sony FX6 in S-Log3 and it was going to be for a delivery of 235 to 1, so I framed accordingly. I started by setting up the Color Space Transform, bringing the Sony S-Log into DaVinci White Gamut, and then I created the output of Rec. 709 Gamma 2.4. Now the image is mathematically correct before I make any adjustments. After I saw this video from Cullen Kelly, I like to fix the exposure and contrast in the same node, setting my pivot to 0.336, which is 18% grey. That way, the contrast is adjusted according to DaVinci White Gamut. For colour balance, I've set this node to linear and dropped the loom mix to zero, setting my pivot to 0.336, which is 18% grey. I was able to remove the magenta and move on to the next node. Thanks to Quasi for the tip. I've adjusted the saturation ever so slightly, but I'm going to go to a bit more extreme later on. But here I bring out the skin and the blue across the whole frame. In this section on power windows, I explore the magic mask and it's very good. It allows me to lower the exposure outside the room so we have more focus on the subject. I wanted to show a bit more blue in the background as a color contrast. I won't go through them individually, but this next lot of power windows show small adjustments, one of which I use the 3D key to isolate the jacket and just want to lift the exposure to bring back some detail in his right lapel. And for the final node, in addition to this grey, I've added a vignette just to increase our focus on the subject. That's how I went from this to this. If you like this video, drop a thumbs up and subscribe for more. I'm the video professor based in Hong Kong with a simple formula of making video creation easy. Shoot, edit, deliver. Follow me on Instagram or get in touch. Thanks for watching.